So one more question. Um, when you add a new social feature, how do you evaluate its success? Um, so we like sort of A-B testing all of our sort of core game features. So what we'll do is we'll give 50% of users um, the sort of control test, which will be like the game without that social feature. And then we'll give the other 50% of users the new feature. And then we'll measure their performance over the next week. So we'll see like how much like group A is retained over group B um, and also like how much money they've spent or how long they've spent in the game or how many sessions. And then once that sort of test is run, we'll look at the two bits of data and we'll say like, okay, this group is performing a lot better or this group isn't. So interestingly this week, I was running a test where uh, we gave people a sprint button or people didn't have a sprint button. And you'd think, oh, a sprint button is really useful and great for getting around the game. But it actually like massively reduced day one retention. So maybe people were running past each other and there wasn't enough social interaction at that point or um, mm -hmm. people were exploring the game too quickly and finding it isn't as good as they wanted it to be. <laughs> <I don't know. laughs> um, but yeah, this A-B testing is, is the key way to work out if your features mm -hmm. are good or not. Sure. Awesome. Oh. <laughs>